Welcome back to another exciting episode on Chet Outdoors. If you're new here, my name is Gunner. If you could do me a favor and go subscribe to my channel, I'd sure appreciate that. Just getting ready, packing up camera gear and stuff. Um, gonna head out to a small prairie lake today, trying to find those suspended schools of crappies. We're gonna bring the four wheeler. We're gonna drill until we can find some, hopefully. Stay tuned, hopefully we can catch some fish. moved over to a spot by the dam took about three seconds and caught a little bass uh. dude don't let that reel come off got him feels like a bluegill yeah. little head shakes ooh that bass are you catching him? little bass there's another one down there. Oh, there's sweet. Well, you bass got the, number you got the bass three. dialed in. <laughs> oh, I just had one looking at it. The jig with the eyes on it, pink twister. Go bass. What is it? Bass number four. There's there's a better mark. Dang it! In his mouth too. He's still down there. Here he comes. Two fish. No. Got him. What the heck? That feels like a bass. The weird head shapes. Yep. Another bass. They're choking it. There we go. Oh man. There he goes. Oh jeez. Got him. Oh. Oh. That was a big crappie. No, he broke my jig off. Oh. What the heck was that? He broke it. That, that was a good one. Good. Oh, here he comes. That one crushed mine. Oh. Hold on, he might still come back. Still down there. Lifted it up. That's three times. I might not have any bait left.
Nice little walleye. Sweet. Come on. Got him. Got him. Hoo hoo hoo. Nice crappie. There we go. Number three. Got him. Oh, that's a better fish. Oh, nice crappie. Oh, that's a good crappie. There's a few. Oh, really oh, hey, barely picked that up. Holy cow, what do you got going on over here? I ain't marking in you. Oh, don't stop. Is your GoPro on? Yeah. There we go. Night bite crappies. There. Is that gold thing working? Yeah. yeah. Lift it up. Dang, did it break? Dude, that was weight all day. Like, I mean. Yeah, no, I got. Holy. Here he comes. Like, right? like some teeth in it. Oh, I got three fish down there. Like no crappie. Oh really? Like. Your jig is still on. Yeah, I can feel it. Oh. Big marks back. Maybe they're walleyes. Go, go. Oh, what is wrong with his back? Oh, dude. Maybe we'll let him live to fight another day. Seriously? Yeah. Okay. There he goes. Yeah, Oh, there's like three of them and I pulled it out of his mouth. Did he bite it? Yeah. You're not even using bait.
It's double. Double. <laughs> Yours is a good one. I went to a plastic and then he ate it. Another one down there. What? There's three on the floor. Yeah, there's one down there. Back to me. Oh, he's coming back. Third time the charm? Yeah. Oh, ho, ho, ho. nice one. Good mark, whatever it is. Lifted it whatever up. Whatever it is. Lifted it up. Oh, we're gonna double. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Get him. Jeez. Night bite crappies. There you go. Nice little crappie. Four. Alright, that wraps up today's video. It was tough to start. We spent the first two hours probably drilling and trying to find these crappies. Found a spot over this heated well. And usually we do good the pass there, but we marked a few so we set up the shack because it was getting cold. Never had a bite, never caught anything there. So we moved and went to the dam. And I think we caught four or five bass I did. We're moving around before dark and we found some crappies finally. We got on them. I think we caught around 12. I caught a little walleye too. Um, I'm using this 27 inch quick tip fray bale rod. I use this always for pan fishing. The thing I like about this is, is anything that you have on there, the tip will load up a little bit. And crappies are up eaters so they'll come up and eat it. And sometimes they'll lift it up so it'll be like that. And it'll lift up and you'll be able to tell because it's straight. So then you know when the fish is there. The other thing is these bullfly jigs are awesome. It's tungsten so it's heavy so you can get down there faster. They come in a size smaller and a size bigger than this. They're really nice. They come in all different colors. Um, I used this for all the crappies yesterday. And never had a problem with them. Uh... Yeah, I really like it. Didn't even need bait with it. I really think it represents some type of little insect in the water, but I sure like them. If you guys like this video, make sure you like, comment, subscribe, and we'll see you next time.